heading out today to do something a little bit different and in my opinion something quite challenging. I'm going to chase some brim on fly. Catching brim on lures can be hard enough some days. Targeting them on fly lifts that challenge to the next level. But I also know it's something that interests a lot of people. So come along with me and have a look. I'm fishing solo this morning with a few cameras set up on the boat in the hope of capturing the action. So I'm using my basic trout fishing fly gear here. I've just got a six weight fly rod the full length floating line, a weight forward line, and I've got about a, uh, a 12 foot leader on there because the fly is weighted and the idea is to get the fly down a little bit, but I don't need to go super deep because I'm just working the edges. Let's see if we can catch one. snag coming up. Really important to get as close to the structure as you can. That'll do for a first cast. I can work my way in. When you're targeting brim or any other fish in and around structure, Casting accuracy is really important. Some days you won't score a bite unless your offering is right in there. Oh yeah, it's a good cast. It deserves a fish. Oh, <laughs> that was a little fella. I pulled him right out of the water. All right, I just had a good bite in here. Let's see if we can get him. There's no one set retrieve that'll always work on brim. I like to mix it up a bit and see what they prefer on the day. close to the edge as I possibly can and giving it a few seconds to get down onto the bottom and then it's just short strips plenty of pauses waiting for that bite sometimes you get fish right away but most of the time you need to work at it keep putting in those casts you won't ever catch a fish if your fly is not in the water. Yes! Aha! Got him this time. Oh, that's not a monster, I don't think, but... Oh, he's not too bad. He's not doing a lot yet. Got him out of the bad stuff anyway. Oh yeah, he's all right. That's what we're after. Brim on fly. I'll just grab the leader. Hmm. Whoa, I probably shouldn't have done that. He's a bit bigger than I thought. Ah, <laughs> uh, there you go. That's what I've been chasing. Brim on fly. It's not a real big one, but it's well and truly legal. And he's nailed that fly. Look, fly choice can be important. Uh, I like something with a bit of life in it, a bit of fur that breathes in the water. I'm using a, a fulling mill uh, Homer Shrimpson, they call them. They're a shrimp pattern. There's a lot of flies that'll work, crazy charlies and gotchas and various creations, as long as it's got a bit of movement in the water and you just got to get it down there in front of them, keep putting it in front of them. And eventually you're going to come up trumps. I'm going to put that one in the live well and see if I can get a bigger one. When 
you get snagged with fly gear, you can often roll cast the fly off the snag. I'll show you what I mean. Okay, that one's in there. Yeah, that's good. Unless you're getting snagged occasionally, you're not trying hard enough. After you get a snag, always just check your leader to make sure there's no nicks in it. I regularly check my fly to make sure the fur or legs aren't tangled around the hook and that the point hasn't been dulled by repeated contact with rocks and snags. The brim are really frustrating today. They're nipping at the fly but not taking it solidly. Tell you what, if I had any hair left, I'd be tearing it out about now. heard one in here and saw the splash so I'm going to try and cover the spot and that's it oh yeah 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 just got to follow in a bump I reckon he's still on it I reckon he's still on it Damn. he bow waved after it A second. Yes. Oh, he's coming at me. Oh, have I got him or not? Yes, I have. Oh, he's bolting out of the shallows towards me. Whoa. <laughs> oh, that was a bit hairy. He grabbed that fly and was coming straight at me. Sometimes you can get them back onto the reel if they're a big fish, but nine times out of ten. You end up just fighting them on loose line like this. <laughs> oh, he's not a bad fish. A little bit more solid. I will definitely use the net for this one. Come on, get in there. Gotcha. Ah. That's a better fish. That's a definite southern black brim, that one. Gorgeous. I love catching brim on anything, but catching them on fly is just really special. Yeah. Oh, he jumped on that. No mistake about that one. Oh, first couple of strips. And he's straight onto it. Oh, only got a, a six pound tippet on. So I need to get him out of that bad country in there. There's rocks and sticks. Luckily, he sort of veered out. Oh, he's picked up some weed. I thought he felt heavy there for the first couple of seconds. He's dived down into the weed when I first pinned him. He's not a bad fish. Actually, it's a branch. It's gum leaves. Must be on the bottom down there. Come on, mate. Ooh, that's a bit risky. Oh, look at that. <laughs> ah, brim with gum leaves. Just 
gorgeous. The broom are eminently catchable on fly. I'm not going to tell you it's easy because it's not, but if you hang in there, keep putting your fly into the right spot, you will catch them. And it's very rewarding when you do. Oh yes, yes, it came back too. Little twitch, and then I, I gave it another little twitch myself, and he nailed it. I've been missing them earlier on, short taking, but they seem to have changed mood a little bit now. Oh, this isn't a bad fish. Oh, come on. Yeah, that, that's all right. Not a monster. Pretty happy with him all the same. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that's the best one so far. That's not a bad sort of brim. Look at that. As I said, you don't need anything really fancy in terms of gear. Any reasonable five to seven weight fly outfit will do the job. Trout gear, in other words. Just remember to give the outfit a good wash with warm, soapy water and dry it really well after using it in the salt. If you enjoyed this clip and would like to see more like it, please take a moment to subscribe to my Starlow Gets Real channel on YouTube. Until next time, tight lines.